Hello, in this video I'll be showing you how to answer the BMAT 2006, section 2, question 3. So we have an isotope X that decays into an isotope Y with a half-life of 4 years. At a particular time, a sample contains 32 times 10 to the power of 20 atoms of X and 4 times 10 to the power of 20 atoms of Y. How many atoms of Y will be present in 8 years' time? So we know a half-life is 4 years, so in 8 years there will be 2 half-lives. So in our first half-life, we have the amount of x reducing by a half, so we'll get 16 times 10 to the 20 atoms of x. And in our second half-life, this amount will reduce again by a half, so we get, after 8 years, 8 times 10 to the power of 20 atoms of x. So we can see in the 8 years that 24 times 10 to the 20 atoms have been converted from x to y. So to work out the amount of atoms of y present, we simply just add the increase to the initial amount of y we had. So that will be 4 times 10 to the 20 plus 24 times 10 to the 20, giving us our answer of 28 times 10 to the power of 20 atoms of y. So our answer here is F.